Ready for commentary will be Sue Smith. And we've got live Bundesliga action on the way. It's Wolfsburg and they face Werder Bremen. Cheers, Guy. Well, it's a pleasure to be here. And I'm anticipating a good game today. The coaching staff have done all they can. Now it's about taking it onto the pitch. Here's how Wolfsburg line up. Yeah, and it looks to be a 4-4-2 and you'd expect the two strikers to occupy both centre-backs. When they attack, they'll combine and the wide midfielders, they'll get forward to provide crosses for them both. Trying his luck. No problem at all in keeping that one out. This is how the visitors start the game. Yeah, looks like a conventional 4-4-2. You don't see it too often anymore, but it should give them a really stable platform both in and out of possession. Baku. And that has stopped any potential danger. The goalkeeper more than ready for it. They take it short. And that's not properly away yet. And he's beaten his man here. Can he finish? And that has gone over the top by quite a distance. Little wayward with the pass, and that'll be a throw-in. Marvin Duksch. Just waiting for the moment to break through. Great defending. Vint. Van Baer. Jonas Vint. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. Reid Labaku. Baku. One of those why not moments, and we've just seen why not. Well, I'm not sure why he's gone for goal there, Guy. It's the wrong option. No accuracy on that whatsoever. Well, there you go. The game's been a difficult watch. Two sides lacking any real endeavour or quality on the ball. Far too many mistakes. Let's hope the game bursts into life soon. Now, can this be attacked? Oh, it's still in there. It had to be, but the defending ensured it wasn't. And on that whistle, the first half comes to an end.